Facebook.com, and I'm joined today by Ron Morelli. He was one of the finalists from Biggest Loser Season 7. How are you doing, Ron? I'm doing really well. How are you? I'm doing great. Thanks. Good. We haven't got to catch up with you in a while, and you're looking fantastic, so it seems like life after Loser has treated you well. It has. Things have been going well. Good. I know a lot of people always wonder when you got, you know, the confetti falls and you guys walk away and that's kind of where the storyline stops and everybody wonders, did they keep it off? Did they not keep it off? What's the journey been like for you to keep it off? Well, you know, when we, when Michael and I, we made the final four and then he made the final three, which was really well. And like you say, the confetti falls and you leave and then you go home and all of a sudden the security of the ranch isn't there anymore. And it's a, and quite frankly, it's a struggle every day. I mean, every day, you know, you got to get up, you got to get to the gym. You know, you come back and you, and you try to build some of the muscle you lost while you were there because Biggest Loser is a great thing, but it's a weight loss show, not a fat loss show. So you never want to build a whole lot of muscle. So you come back and putting on that muscle at first, it's a shock because you're actually putting weight on, you know, it's like, uh oh, what's happening, you know? So, Everybody goes through it and, you know, they put on a dozen or so pounds, but you actually look better because you, you feel more physically fit and you look more physically fit. You don't look so thin. Okay. And uh, and like I say, it's not easy. It's hard. It's hard work and you just got to go through it and make it happen. That's great. Well, you right now are spending four weeks out at Biggest Loser Resort and I think you've already been there for a few weeks. Um, is this your first trip out there? It is my first trip out here. I came out, Michael and I came out to visit Max just for one weekend uh, a while ago, and then and that was really it. And then this is my first real trip out here staying. Uh, I'm in my third or fourth of four weeks, and it's, I have to tell you, I see what Max sees in this place. It's a great place. they got a great program. Um, you learn a lot here, and, you know, it's, it really works out well. It's, it's amazing to see how many people come back just as like a refresher course. You know, they've been here for two weeks in the past and they come back, you know, for a week every couple of years just to kind of brush up on, uh, you know, get their batteries recharged again. Mm -hmm. I was there, um, I got to go out for a week last year and I was amazed that there were overweight people, there were really obese people, and there were mm -hmm. really thin people and that kind of caught me off guard. And a lot of people were telling me that it's their me week. Like they took a week of vacation and they went out there just to unplug and recharge. So right. I think, um, you know, people, it's a great place to go to just focus on yourself and, you know, whether that's weight loss or just, you know, whatever that is for you, it's a great, great place for that. Right. Absolutely. I mean, the food's great. The programs they have here are good. And uh, like I said, you're exactly right. It runs the gamut of people that are, you know, basically physically fit, but are coming out here because they really want to, you know, just rejuvenate themselves with, you know, massages or facials and eat right and hike and do all that, all the way to the people that were like myself, extremely overweight and need to come out here for a whole lifestyle change. Right. Well, Ron, these days you're down to 260-ish and mm -hmm. that's phenomenal coming. You started on Biggest Loser at 430, so that's just phenomenal weight loss and you look great. Um, you and the Morelli family have a book coming out this spring called Fat Family, Fit Family, right? Right. Yeah, we do. We wrote it as family, myself, my wife, and Michael and Max. And um, it's just our story and our journey on how we went. I mean, we were all big. You know, my wife used to be 260 pounds. She's half the size now. You know, I used to be 530. I'm almost half the size. Michael was pushing 400 pounds. He's down to a little over two. Max, well, you've seen his journey, you know, 430 pounds, and he's down almost 200 pounds. It's, it's just an amazing story. So it's just the story from our, from our eyes and where we have came from, you know, how we lived our lives and got to where we were and then how we lost it again. What I love about the story is that it's very, it feels just very like American family because – you hear a lot of like people's individual journeys and you see a lot of, you know, books out there about people going through weight loss on their own, but I think this really touches on a point that's really important and that's doing it as a family. That way you're all supporting one another, you're all accountable to one another, and in the end, you know, you all come out better together. So, I really love the story. Thank you very much. Well, Ron, it's been a 
pleasure catching up with you, and we definitely look forward to seeing the book here in a few weeks. And uh, you okay. you keep those boys in line. Oh, I will. <laughs> if they don't keep you in line first. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Thanks, Ron. For dietsandreview.com, this is Brandy Kosky.